We'll now look at some of the different types of variables in statistics. So there are going to be different ways to classify variables. The first is going to be what's known as qualitative and quantitative. And we'll start with qualitative. Qualitative variables are any kind of variables that can be put into distinct categories. As a result, these are sometimes also called categorical vari variables. And these can be things like eye color, religion, or gender. These kind of things that have clear definitive categories. On the other hand, quantitative variables, these are things that can be counted or measured. Sometimes these are also known as numerical variables because they're going to be the things that we deal with numbers a lot. These can include height, your age, or the number of views on this video. Quantitative variables can also be broken down into two different categories. The first of these is known as discrete variables, and these are things that can be counted. These can include things like money, your number of siblings, or the number of cars in a parking lot. The other thing that we can have is continuous variables. And continuous variables are anything that we can measure. The important thing about continuous variables is they can assume an infinite number of values, as some examples, height, weight, or distance. When someone asks you your height and you say 5'7", Chances are you're not exactly five foot seven inches. You might be five point or five foot seven point one inch or seven point zero five inches. So these are the idea of continuous variables. They're not set counting numbers, but instead they can range between this interval. So let's look at some examples of classifying these variables. Here we have two examples. The first is the number of members of Congress. This will be a number, which tells us that it is quantitative. And then from there, we have to decide whether or not it's discrete or whether it's continuous. In this case, we're looking at the number of members of Congress. And if they're all lined up in front of you, you should be able to count them, which tells us that this is discrete. When we talk about blood pressure, blood pressure is also a number. So that would also be quantitative. However, we don't count your blood pressure, instead it's measured, so this is continuous. Two more examples. First, political affiliation. Political affiliation is not a number, instead you get placed into a category, which tells us that this is a qualitative variable. For age of a student, we know that age is a number, which tells us quantitative. And then we need to know, is this counted or measured? And age is a little bit of a tricky one because most people want to say that it's counted, but this is actually continuous. The idea is that you continuously age. You don't just jump up a year all of a sudden. This is a slow process of aging, and therefore we do have continuous. Two more examples, hair color. Hair color is something that is going to be placed into a category, which tells us qualitative. And number of students, well, we are now dealing with numbers, which tells us quantitative. And if we have all of the students in front of us, we can not count those, so that's discrete. Our last one is either social security number or credit card number, any type of identifying number like that. And this one can be tricky because it does say the word number in there, which makes us think it's a number and would hence be quantitative. But this is actually a qualitative variable. Although it is a number, these are not numbers that we can do calculations with, which makes it not quantitative. Instead, we're in qualitative. In addition, if you break down a social security number or a credit card number, each of these numbers comes in groups. Social security number has a group of three, a group of two, a group of four. Credit card numbers have four groups of four. And each one of those groups does have a meaning that tells you something. It just happens to be represented by a number. So this is qualitative.